Hello everyone, my name is Kirsten. I'm a Gold Award Girl Scout. As you probably already know, starting the take action process can be challenging, especially when making sure your project is in fact take action and not community service. I highly recommend that you go over plenty of examples of both take action and community service projects to help the Girl Scouts differentiate the two. This really helped me to develop a solid take action project. In addition, when helping a Girl Scout find a project, recommend that they reflect on issues that they are already passionate about. The more passionate they are on their issue, the more they will enjoy teaching and learning throughout their project. In addition, make sure the girls choose the most appropriate audience and volunteers to receive or help with the completion of their Take Action project. Let's take my project for example. My Gold Award project was on marine mammal conservation and rescue. This was a very meaningful, impactful, and fun project for me because I was already passionate about the marine environment and the issue of stranded seals and sea lions. The issue of stranded seals and sea lions worked out great for my project because I already had a deep respect for my target audience, which was the Seal Beach Junior Lifeguard community and knew they would make the most impact in carrying out the lessons I created since they already spend so much time in the marine environment. Most importantly, the girls need to understand that each project should eventually extend beyond the community and make a larger global impact. Lastly, I recommend that you advise the Girl Scouts to stay in contact with their Girl Scout advisor who will motivate them and help the Girl Scout, especially throughout any difficulties that they might encounter. I could have not embarked on my project without the valuable lessons I attained from the Gold Award workshops and from my advisor, Miss Ann Crane. Thank you so much for helping our Girl Scouts succeed.